What is going on guys? It's your boy Big Dylan. Welcome back to another Destiny Azir video. Today he's located in the tower to the left hand side just across from the speaker. Anyway, let's see what he's brought for us. So the engram this week is a legacy special weapon engram. Do not pick this up as it gives you year one light level gear. For Titans, he's brought the Doom Marchers. Decent exotic, he's got an 88% stat roll, so pretty low. Um, wouldn't really recommend picking these up as there are better exotics out there for Titans in PvP. Um, mainly the Twilight Garrison if you're after mobility. And for the Hunters this week, he has brought sealed Ahamkara's Grasps. Okay exotic, it's mainly for PvE again if you want to survive on the Night Stalker, you know, throw your smoke down, go invisible. Basically you gain an additional melee charge, pretty decent. And he's got a 99% stat roll on these, so very good roll indeed. For the Warlocks, he has actually brought Alchemist's Rainment. Probably the worst exotic in the game, in my opinion. He's got a 94% stat roll. Don't pick this up whatsoever, guys. It's terrible. If you want it in your collection, fair enough. But other than that, it's just absolute terrible. For the weapon, he's brought Red Death. Pretty okay-ish exotic. Obviously, the archetype of pulse rifle it's in right now isn't particularly that great. So again, if you want it in your collection, you can pick it up. Other than that, wouldn't really recommend picking this one up. Anyway, for the weapon ornaments, he's brought not a toy for the Zala Supercell, Crucible Assassin for the Trespasser. He's brought Plasma Drive, Emerald Coil, Heavy Ammo Sins, Three of Coins, Glass Needles, and obviously the Motor Light for Strange Crown Exchange. Anyway guys, hopefully this helps. Drop a like on the video if you enjoyed. Be sure to buy loads of 3 of coins. Subscribe to the channel for daily Destiny videos and peace.